Again, about cooperative learning. Um, okay. I'm sorry. Yeah. Cooperative learning <laughs> yeah, yeah. is basically setting up an atmosphere in, in um, a curriculum or yeah. um, club that people learn from each other and, and learn and can um, play off of each other's strengths. Um, Austin's strengths, uh, actually very good with the computer. He can come up with images like this. Hmm. Um, very quick thinking. Um, Michaela, lots of energy. Just <laughs> lots of sugar in the morning. Jesus, go. But very enthusiastic, wanting to jump in color and all. And Rob, um, the older, uh, one of the older um, veterans here, great detail. He okay. understands what needs to be done to finish something. Samantha is, is just steadfast and true. She is here 24 7. And it's all just, about business. All about business. Good, so, good. Samantha comes up and she stands here and shows, all right, people, time is money. Time is money. <laughs> Let's move on. She is. <laughs> yes, yes. Wow. She takes the Rebecca here is our um, silent Da Vinci. Okay. She, she has this beautiful, elegant, stroke with the brush. She did these drawings, these paintings of one of the flowers that looked like this giant, beautiful watercolor flower. And, and she just just has this touch to it. And uh, she is an artist. Hmm. Not about it. Just, and this is when we need her. We need everyone's and, and if everybody was talking as much as Michaela, we would all all over. But <laughs> this is this is a good combination for okay. work for each other. Okay. Great. So not only the talent but the personality and Really, my hope as a teacher, I would say kind of like as a father too, would be like you want all your children to like talk to each other when they grow up, when they leave the house. Well, when you go to the next step, high school or college, you will cross paths again. And you know, you might be in a college when you might call Rob or vice versa and you're, you can connect those ideas again. Because artists, we're a little small, unique little group. And we need support with each other. And um, I'm having my 30th reunion in high school and I contacted someone who I have not seen in 33 years. But the point is, I remember what part of the life they were.